Hello and welcome back to Total War Warhammer with the Cult of Pleasure and of course our lightly clothed leader Morafi over here on her dark steed and her pole arm even though she has two swords but you know let's not uh, fight about that um this episode is probably going to be one of many pieces because we're going to make peace with Hack Graf. We are going to make peace with the humans because I've seen that Master Mundi has made his way back into Hexodal yeah. and this army cannot take care of him. Like, yes. this is too weak to defeat Hexodal and Master Mundi, so I will move them back up north to defend Maku Peaks and Shotex Causeway. That the army can do. And we're going to make peace with the humans. Even though it seems foolish because we're so much stronger than the humans. But I, I don't want to fight them anymore. So, if you could please give me the humans. Uh, the Teeth Snatcher are also fighting yes. us. Yeah, they are pretty strong, they have a lot of arms. land still, but... Is it war? It is war, but we are here to make peace and... I'm gonna demand all of your money, basically. Yeah, no, but I, I need, like, all of your money. So be it. Yes, thank you. Okay, so we have peace with the humans. That's great. What? Means we can move this army back north. Uh, I didn't really want this province, but now we have it. Uh, so, whatever. Madness. We have a little bit more money on our disposal. The next thing we are going to do is probably make peace with Hakraf because we're going to attack Cloud Spire, conquer it, and then we're going to go over to the Ice Spire and then just, uh, you know, get these three provinces under our control. And over here we are going to attack Current Car. And with that we have made peace with them because I don't intend to attack these provinces up north. We could try to confederate with Hark Ganev because they do have Hargenev and the Road of Skulls up here, fully under their control. Um... Tyrant. I'm sure your little message will be most interesting. Yeah, most interesting. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Um... Short -sighted. Maybe, maybe later, because you're rather weak. Um, I'm gonna save some money up, because I want to maybe confederate with them, and I think that's going to be the turn. Um, what is... You have two bodyguards, and all of you have gained ranks down there. Good. Negarond is still very busy fighting Lovan, and Lovan is f fighting back quite hardly here. We have a lot of their forces. Hexotl is scary because they have an army nearby, and they could march against us, but no, they have not done that. I could try to make peace with Hexotl, if I were to choose so. Resta, Ravra, Ravato, and Felician. Felician, isn't that the, <laughs> the mage that we are working for? Okay, you are retreating. There's a lot of elven factions we are at war with, which makes sense, you know, we are the dark elves, they are the elves, we don't like each other. Apparently I've got another achievement. Advisor. What is this achievement doing for me? It is... Ah, have two heroes, level 20. Interesting. Well, we do have, we do have that. So that's not, not bad. What's happening over there? Um, oh, it's it's the siege. Okay, it's a it's a chaos siege. Felician has gained a bodyguard. Raiding, Sulfurets is under siege. You are strict. That's good. Um, I am just conquer this province real quick. Again, we don't need to do this battle ourselves. Arms, we are way too strong to bother with these small battles. Occupy the settlement. And. Let's see what we have for a special building over here. Corruption is right. Um, it's support. No, it's 
Uh, there should be a special building. I don't see it though. Landmark. Oh, there it is. Gate to the Underworld Sea. Clarex by a landmark. The Underworld Sea is a cavernous ocean under Nagarov that allows Juchi navies to swiftly travel from coast to coast. Oh. oh, that's pretty cool. First of all, that provides a good garrison force. Which is nice because we hope that these. You know, we are hoping that the Chaos armies are going to spawn over here still. That's that's why we need a strong garrison force. And also, we get like a lot of other bonuses. So, destroy this. Actually, no. The landmark needs to have a level 3 building, so no need to destroy it. We are going to attack Clark Current. That is going to be a battle that we are going to do ourselves. Because this army is not that strong. It's actually going to be a rather close battle. Yeah, I mean, melee attack, you get that. The shades are going to be strong, but it's going to be hard to take on these uh, troops on the walls. So we're going to continue the siege now. We're going to attack it at the end of the turn, so that's no problem. And now we are going to move you back up north. So get into a force march. And I'm gonna move you to the Monument of the Sun, actually. Just so that you continue to stay in the province. And help a little bit with the public order. And we're going to try to make another confederation with these people. Indeed they do, my friend. Not quite yet. Um, I don't know if I want to save up more money or if I just want to do it now. Going to get the arcane conduit. Tyrant peak. This army. Maybe this army is actually going to move up north and take over these provinces because I don't want to spend. Have Morafi's army be weakened by colonizing these provinces. This army can do that f just fine. Um, so. Just move up here. Do not vex us further. And you can. Not move. Tyrant Peak has a rebellion go currently going on. Down here in Silverets. I don't think the army is too bad. Yeah, it has a lot of marauders. It's not not that strong. We have the lair over here. And yeah, I'm just gonna spend my money. So the Ashen Coast needs, uh, obviously. Public order is a big problem in many provinces. For example, the Cord Coast over here. But Hotex Column is fine. Um, I'm still gonna do build the Den of Indulgence. Let's upgrade the Guild Falls here. Then we have the Broken Lands, which is what I just conquered. Um, I might just want to build a Garrison Force real quick here. The Black Flood is, uh, of course, this province over here. Which does not have a building to get uh, public order, but we're going to upgrade the mines of Hackcraft. And that's going to be that. And I think that's that's our turn done. What are you? You're the death hack. You are spreading corruption, so... Why don't you get, um... I mean, soothsaying is pretty nice, but... I don't need that. Conviction, maybe. And then we have the death hack down here. She's going to spread some corruption. Commandment available over here. Definitely get uh, public order. Siege cuts. Oh yeah, I forgot that. I forgot that. Uh, we wanted to do this battle. This might be a very short episode, by the way. Uh, you are Moraf. Wait, what? What? Dude, I'm so confused. I thought we already had her on level 39. <laughs> what? Anyway, she's going to get upkeep reduction for her troops. That's going to give me more money, the obviously. Sombra. And we are going to attack Clark Car uh, Karen Car now. Go kill! So Let them know death's touch. Let them know death's touch. Uh, they have. Oh, oh shit! They have a a thing nearby. For That's going to be interesting. For victory. They have a black arc in range. How intriguing. I should probably have one too, but I just can't afford it. Okay, we're definitely going to try to attack from this side. Just rush down here. 
Uh, we need to get on the walls as quickly as possible. And our cavalry is going to be completely useless, so that's a shame. I could try to take out the gate with them. Or maybe fire with my... No, they, these guys need to focus on the troops. Especially on the Black Guard of Nagarond. It's going to be an interesting battle. Like, they have a death hack, but we have a lord. So, they will equal each other out a bit. My lord is going to be a better... Uh fighter and uh I think she has a horse or a cold one so she's not going to fight on the walls where the death hack will be so that's a problem Corin Banir against Lositel I do love her shields okay here we go yeah I want to attack on this side because um they don't have towers over there so let's get the shades Ready. Bolt throwers. Bolt throwers, of course. Corsairs. And then the Corsairs right here. She does not have a cold one. That's actually really good. And that's our army. Move up. So yeah. Um, get out of harm's way. And you're just firing away and uh, yeah that's good just charge at the walls right away so will our lord while my shades are doing a lot of damage as are my my bolt throws here but the black arcos there's the hand force have no chance they're getting absolutely destroyed i don't know where his black uh, his neck yeah his black guard are oh are they over there yeah no that's black arcos yes over here maybe oh that's his death hack but they, I think they're down there too, either way. But yeah, we are dealing, uh, doing a lot of damage here with our artillery and our troops. Up on the walls, you bastard! Kill them all! Yeah, the dark shots, they can't even fire at us because we're so quick on the walls here. And damn, our artillery is just going wild on them. And the, oh, the shards, the shades are so strong, it's unbelievable. Uh, can you just try to destroy the gate? Maybe. I don't know where their lord is. Still over there. Okay. Black Ark Prisoners are not fighting up here. As they should. There's the Black Guard of Nagarond. Could you fire at them? No, no, where's the Black Guard of Nagarod? We must fire at them. It's very important. They are going to be strong. We do have this Dark Conduit, so let's try that right here. Uh, ally? Well, okay, let's do it on our Lord. Oh my god, what the? Strong with this a single unit, large explosion area causes. Okay, so it's just. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. That's That was pretty powerful, too. Uh, stop and fire on whomever. Get down there. And get our shades up here. Yeah. Our lord can just attack them over here. And... We did lose a single thing over there. These firing at my cavalry, but I don't really mind that too much. I'll attack these Black Ark Corsairs then. While you get down there and attack the Black Ark Corsairs that are still fighting us. Dual Sword Infantry. Are they all Dual Sword? Yeah, they are. Hmm. Interesting. Why is my cavalry halfway inside of already? Well, let's destroy the gate. You attack the black Arcosers over here. Yeah, that's pretty good. And we now have the black prowess. Actually, I think both of us have them. Have it. That's pretty funny. It is really strong. Get out the black Arcosers down here. And our shades are going to move right there. Do not flee though. Just, just move right up there. 
our lord just doing a lot of damage as they should okay our dark riders are partly partially in the <laughs> inside the city and get our lords uh, our corsairs to attack the lord well another corsair unit should help up here easy battle it was pretty cool like the fight on the walls was pretty cool and the battle a decisive victory and with that we have current car under our control easiest money in my life Each player faction has its, has its own victory conditions, which, if achieved, will win them the game. Victory conditions can be viewed on the objectives panel. Well, that's not true, because everyone has kind of the same at this point. Um, which is, do the rituals, and you're gonna be good to go. Yeah, trades killed a bunch of people, the artillery did a good job, the cavalry just was there to soak up damage, really, from the towers, which they have done quite a good job at <laughs> I thought the black arc cause uh, the black guard of Nagarond would kill a couple more of my units but they didn't and the death hack if he had used that aggressively while my troops climbed climbed the walls he would have killed a lot of my men with these uh, with this death hack Does anyone notice that the Dark Elves are extremely white? Like, they're very, very white. Pale would also be a good, <laughs> a good word to use instead of white, I guess. Uh, then again, it makes sense because I think their land has like no sun whatsoever. It's like that's. It's very cold and all that stuff, so it, it makes sense that they are very pale. But, you know, when you usually think of a dark elf, they are dark skinned too. Not, not these ones. <laughs> they do still love torture. Uh, well, not done on them, but doing it on others. Okay. Yeah, thank you. I am beyond defeat! Yeah, I am beyond defeat too. It's Power, occupied dark and violence. banner, a razor banner, and we have control over current car. Current car People also has a special restless. building, and let me guess, it is the slave traders' palaces. Oh, that's not what I expected. This palace is the result of years of black breaking labor, back breaking labor. Somebody else's, of course, not mine. <laughs> no, no. Income from slave pens and slave markets, all regions in this province. Not bad. A slave decline rate minus five percent. And slave public order penalty minus ten percent in all provinces, and the, of course the black arcos. Yes. Okay, it is basically what I expected. So, yeah, uh, we're going to get rid of this and build, of course, the slave pens. And that is that's all she wrote. We're going to destroy this, and then we're gonna make peace with them. Awesome. Of course, she has a new um. Get public order, please. Zuki. Get more public order. Why did you get two levels there? But just one more province to conquer. And we are good to go. I think I'm gonna have Marathi just stay up there for now. Until I know where the Chaos Armies are going to spawn. But then again, we need a garrison force. Or something in our capital. Because of how strong the intervention armies are. Also, I don't know where the next rituals are going to be, is another problem. And you're not too worrisome. Um, they might be able to attack. Yeah, they have an army up here. But they might be able to sh move south. Actually, I don't think he has that many troops.
But we're gonna make peace with them anyways. Um, again, I might just try to get Hard Genev to confederate with me. But it wouldn't be important. Uh, you know, it's not necessary. Hostile. Technology research. Hit and run. Yes. Nice. Um... I might just go for upgrade 2 now, because I, I mean, I would like to have the speed for Hydras and stuff. And Daylight Denied is also... That's pretty good. Income from settlements. Oh man, that's... That's just really good. But I think we need... We need to start getting these new upgrades. But then again, 10% income from all settlements. That is just... That's just too good. I wish we could upgrade our technology speed somehow. Um, that would be pretty good. I don't think we can build anything to do that. Sadly. So, Karen Carr, you're just going to get the slaver. Oh, you can't. Huh? Uh, that's a shame. Oh, you're gonna get the Delephant Dungeons and all the cultist gathering. For now, you're going to attack Ice Spire. Destruction. Really? You can't attack it? I am the first That's a bit annoying. A That's a bit blood. annoying. You are going to march purpose. to Machu Peach. Machu Peaks. The people are displeased. Uh, yes. Move you over here. Draws. And... Can we make peace with Master Mundi? Probably not. Malevan Probably I don't want to. Hold the black court. Few um, see its splendor and live to tell of it. Yes. He is very weak on money and troops, but I doubt he is going to confederate Ridiculous. just yet. Yeah. Yes, we are even equally as Malachis, strong. Yes. Lord of the Black Tower and King of Nagaroth. Yes, I know. Noble of Nagaroth, speak! Uh, these guys I, I could make peace with, but not just yet, not quite yet. Um, like, you're at war with the law masters, but you're just not doing anything. I don't know what, what's up with you. Um, apparently, I can live in, the, in this climate. Oh, I clicked out of the window. Sorry. Uh, what else? Okay. It's a pretty sweet tower right here. I don't know what Melikov is doing, to be honest. He's just chilling. I might, I might try to give him the order to just, hey, Melikov, why, why don't you just, why don't you just go into Tech Salvation Island? Speak. Supremacy. Hegemony over all lands. No treasures, no resources, no realms are out of reach of the Druchi. Okay. Go and attack. Uh, not that province. This province right here. Attack Salvation Islands, if you can. And maybe get... Uh, the others are not actually doing anything. Lord of... Whether you know, this was Dini, uh, not, I, I would like to make a trade with you. <laughs> but he doesn't want to. How's slave going? We need more slaves. But I'm just not fighting enough battles or... Taking enough... Uh, I'm not plundering anything, is the problem. Should probably start doing that. But I wanted to conquer all of this land. So. Yes. That's what you are. A hag. <laughs> Corruption of the vilest sources. We have a sorceress abode. We need this. And, a, and this. Let's get the harpies roost next. So that we can finally get some black dragons up in here. I also would like some... Uh, I would like some Hargan of Executioners and all that stuff. Ooh, actually we need the san Sanctum of Quintex. First of all, that's going to give us more... Yeah, that's giving us research rate. And mi minus 90% penalty due to presence of corruption. Public order penalty due to presence or lack of corruption. And I think that is good. That does sound good. Like... Wow, this is this is this is weird. Like, we have ninety-eight percent corruption, and there's still minus one percent lack of corruption. I feel like that's a bit that's a bit harsh. 
But uh, once we have this new building, it's going to be good. Um, why don't we build the halls of hedonism over here? And I think that's going to be the turn. Hopefully, Malekif is going to attack Lovan here and just take some of their land. Order of Law Masters. I need to move south and defeat Hexodal. No, oh, I can't. That's the problem because I don't want the last defenders to get in on the race and they will probably have more than enough plaques to do some rituals. And I don't really have the money to just send intervention armies against them. Ravenna Gatesmiter. She lost. Oh, well, that's very unfortunate, isn't it? Yeah, Hagrath has only three settlements, which one is up here, one is down there, and one is there. I'm going to conquer this one. I'm not gonna do anything with it. I could actually move up and... Yeah, that's a, what I'm gonna do now. I should have done that with Mudrathi before. I'm gonna move up there and... Um, sack it. For slaves. Of course. <laughs> So, yeah, we don't have that. It is quite far away, but with the forced march, we're going to reach it next turn. So yeah, that's that's nice. Um, you have also dark desires. Yep, as expected. And we're going to occupy it. Ice spy on the first of many settlements to be gained down here. Um, we're gonna build the cultist gathering because we need public order here rather quickly. Because the chaos corruption is. Nah, it's not low, but it's not high enough. Ain't no chaos corruption high enough. I am now a treasure hunter. Because I have 10 magical weapons or armor pieces. Mako Peaks needs. I don't know if I'm probably going to upgrade the Shrine of Sotek. Definitely going to build a cultist gathering over here and let's destroy this. We don't need that. Uh, the Fallen Gates. Let's upgrade the cultist gathering. You are my assassin. And I could give you more, more points over here, but what is income from slaves? No, not really. Needed. Um. Get, get the Counter Striker. Vortex upgrade available. Ritual of the Unrequited Lover in progress. The ancient city of Quintex, Sildra Tor, and Hark Grav. Okay, that's actually really good because these cities are all easily defended. I mean, Hark Grav is going to get a garrison force soonish. I might destroy this to have um, the garrison force being built here. So yeah, let's uh, let's try this. Sildra Tor already has a garrison. Corruption it has, does not have a garrison force. Sword. So I de do need to destroy this too. It's bad because it's it's money that we are not getting. I'm gonna build the dark elf, uh, the artisan's house over here then. And we need that money kind of, but we need um, we need garrison Come. forces. Luckily, in Leviathan Rage finally has a dra dragon mount. Now that's something I'd like to hear. Now the problem is where are the Chaos armies going to spawn? Because they could spa still spawn over here, or they could spawn something somewhere else, which is a problem. And I don't know what Malekif is doing, he's just chilling there on his black dragon. He is not doing anything. How exciting. Thank you very much for your contribution, Malekith. Oh, it's a uh, Sephara. Not to be confused with Setra. Hark Grav is weak. So is Hark Ganev, but oh well. 
So we're gonna lose like a lot of gold actually, like 600 gold or something along the lines. Because I've destroyed two of these buildings. But the garrison forces are going to be very necessary. Um, yeah, we've destroyed the conscription house down here. Let's build a slave market, not a slave pens. Sildra Tor, yeah, corruption is good if that's right. Sildra Tor is going to get the garrison force, and so is Hack Graf. I have dark purpose. Yes, you can already move I your move army move over. Ah, oh, wow, that's that's cool. That's really cool. You now have black dragon. Hag you go into normal stance Destroy and attack this all. province. To the vengeful Automatically. And we're going to sack this the province, of course. Louder. And now we're going to make peace. With Hack Graf. Of the witch, a thousand cruel curses greet you. Say your peace. Uh, I would like to have trade with you. All possible. Not not the non aggression pack, just trade. Maybe I would even pay you some gold. That I just stole from you. Denied. Well then I'm gonna take your gold. If you don't want to trade with me. Like, I don't mind. Yeah, just give me all of it. Low, huh? Foolish request. Well, not really. I mean, it's foolish of you to say no because... I am kind of very powerful. Gladly. Gladly, yeah. Oh, yeah. Lord of fear. Sadly, we cannot trade with Hargenev. Thrives on plots and um, we could try to confederate Please with them now. And they will probably accept with a couple of ten thousand gold. Do I want this, though? Do I desire to have these provinces under my control? Is the question. They would do it, but do I want it? First of all, I'm gonna get it. A penalty. I mean, Hagenev is certainly something. Yeah, I think. I don't know what the. Is it the Temple of Cain, the Tautropus? No. Uh, Hagenev is certainly something I would like, and he has a complete province over here. He does have a single building over here, the Great Arena, and then another one over here, the Frozen City. I don't mind too much about them. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go for it. Let's try. Noble it's going to cost me all of my gold. Is a dangerous place. But I would like his provinces before he, you know, gets too strong again. So have all of my gold. Ill considered. We're not gonna spend too much of our gold then. Yeah, just in case we can get him to confederate with us next time. Foe seeker. Settlement upgrade is not really a, my concern. You need to move south. Go to the. Go over here. And yeah, we want the Chaos Armies to spawn over here because we can then easily defeat them. We don't yet have our garrison forces ready, up and running over here, of course. So we're gonna wait. We are going to wait. Exodal has disappeared again, which is probably a good thing for me. He might try to attack me down here. But I'm gonna build garrison forces just everywhere now. Chotex Causeway. I wish this would give me garrison forces. I can't justify to build anything just in case I can get a confederation. So I'm gonna end the episode here. I thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it, then consider leaving a like and a comment down below. And we will see us in the next episode. Until then, take care. Mm, bye!